Hello, my name is Andy Mogglesdew. I'm the Chief Editor of AUB Review. Today I would like to introduce you to the latest edition of AUB Review, called Through the Eyes of Machines. Many of the articles in this edition look at how machines are able to see and perceive their surroundings, and so close the loop, enabling manufacturing and operational processes to react to real-time situations. Machine vision is often considered to be at the heart of AI. Machine vision is what gives us self-driving cars, for example. In manufacturing, it also plays a role in spotting anomalies and so contributing to quality control. But we can do far more than quality control. In real-time inspection, data can be fed back to the control system to identify and then correct errors. The, the camera and visual inspection system thus become part of the control loop. In this article, we look at camera and visual inspection systems from BNR, AUB's Machine and Automation Division. Many traditional robot applications work with rigid, rigid objects, for example, welding car bodies. Every car body on the production line has the same shape and needs to be welded in the same location. Not all manufacturing lines are like that. What about, what about if the workpiece is made of flexible material, for example, like rubber? And each object is slightly different in a different position, deformed slightly differently. In a research project, AUB has shown that it is possible to accurately work with such objects. A camera creates a 3D model of the object and then it allows a working robot to accurately target positions on the object, for example, to apply glue. AI is rapidly transforming the world around us and there is much more to AI than smart chatbots. There is probably no area in industry that is not in some way changed by AI. AI is helping guide decisions, helping recognise patterns and it can even be integrated into control loops. AUB's Accelerator program is supporting and accelerating the rollout of AI across the company. This starts from evaluating the potential business value, ecosystems and personal people development, and it seeks to scale the delivery of AI projects. Battery energy storage systems, or BESS, are a growing part of the energy landscape. Sites, be they factories or hospitals, have their own battery storage. On the one hand, this means that they can continue to provide essential services when the grid supply goes down. But the importance of BESS has grown beyond that. For example, if one site has rooftop photovoltaics, there could be times that it's rational to sell surplus energy to the grid. But there are other times it makes sense to store it for late use later. Such a storage system thus delivers greater supply security, but also economic savings. Not to mention the reduction in emissions through a greater use of renewables. Despite all this, there are still barriers to their adoption. Not least of these barriers are the costs and uncertainties for, for the investors. AUB is helping bring customers on board by providing BESS as a service, meaning the customer does not have to provide the initial investment, but can buy this as a service. You can discover these articles and many others in the latest edition of AUB Review. You can download it online on our website, abb.com slash abbreview. I hope you enjoy this, this latest edition of AB Review and that you discover many exciting things about machine vision and how AI is changing the world we live in.